Yo, real talk. Real talk. Uh, nigga. Oh, we got to start. Did you just fart, nigga? What the fuck was that? <laughs> Man, no, sorry. So, CDs. Got I know my collection is fucking crazy to this How old were you when you got your first CD? Or, I don't remember. I was making bootlegs and buying bootlegs at an early age, my nigga. <laughs> oh, out the pussy, nigga. <laughs> she thought she was giving birth. CDs were sliding out of her slit. Like, you know. Got, uh, CDs were the true mixtapes, mix CD, Beanie Siegel, Cosmic Strictly Skills, Kev mixtape. Ooh, that's the one Beans broke Cosmic Kev jaw over. Mm. We don't forget that shit, nigga. She used to play uh, in the club with just Jay-Z verse. Yeah. <laughs> it's a 50 second song getting 400 spins a day. Do you think Seek still can fight? Yeah, but it's like, it's like on Mario, he just gotta get behind him. <laughs> <laughs> Jump with his back. <laughs> Blue. Then he just stretches out and disappears. That's what he does. Okay. No, CDs though, man. Yeah. How, how was your collection? Alright, my collection started off real gay. <laughs> oh, the other CDs touching each other's dicks? I got my first CD player when I was like 12, right? Yeah. And my mom didn't want me listening to anything with cusses in it. So my aunt and them would try to abide by her wishes but buy me stuff. Oh, so I want to say my first two CDs were... Uh, TLC's Crazy Sexy Cool Good CD. and the Waiting to Exhale soundtrack. That's gay. I was just a 12 year old boy in my room talking <laughs> about let's make it happen. Seriously, I, I think I started fucking when I was like 15. Because you had them CDs. Girls would just put them CDs on and then, and then they would lay down. That's, you know something? That's probably why I didn't get no ass for a while because all I had was hard rap. <laughs> <laughs> I used to put on MTV jams and fuck chicks. Is that, is that bad? I've seen porn. With MTV Jam playing in the background. Yeah, give you some good rhythm. Oh, that is great. Did you keep your CDs neat? I had to start buying them myself, and I saw how much work it took to get $15 to $18 to buy a CD. Mm -hmm. Yes. Once we started burning them things ourselves, no. I hate when people try to actually borrow a CD, and then you look at their collection, and it's just... <laughs> it looks like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich of CDs. Yeah, it's just know? sticky and nasty. <laughs> Do you have a CD cleaning kit? Oh, I had I had my dad bought like three of them jokes. The stupid little dude. Yeah, you got this thing and you oh. and they had this cleanser that you would spray and it's cleaning my CDs. It was scratch free and you know all it was was alcohol, watered down alcohol. See, and that's the thing you guys need to remember that when new electronics come out and they try to sell you bullshit accessories, it's like no, I'm not gonna need this down the line. <laughs>